I'm making up a new story, and I'm just trying to decide who it's about. I know Benji. Oh, <laughs> hello, Benji. Well, aren't you a fine-looking fellow? Would you like to be in my new story, along with the other toys? He said yes. Yay! <laughs> right, now. Where shall our story begin? Oh, yes. <clears throat> Once upon a tale in Lionheart Town, Benji Elephant woke up with a big yawn. He said goodbye to his mummy and daddy and left the trumpety tree. And trumpeted to school. Good morning, Benji. Race ya! <laughs> Benji played games all the way to class. <laughs> Oops, a daisy. <laughs> Clippity clop hooray! Who is here today? <laughs> Bella, Rafi, Lily Mae, and Benji. <laughs> Today is show and tell day. You will each come to the front and talk about your favourite thing. And the school principal will be joining us. <laughs> now off you go. Play and explore. It will get your ideas flowing for your show and tell. I shall keep watch from here and ring the bell when you need to return. <laughs> Everyone was excited about show and tell. Everyone oh. except Benji. Benji was feeling nervous. Hello. Ah, ah. <laughs> welcome to Monty's most brilliant, brilliant bookshop. How can I help you? I oh, oh, I see. Whatever is the matter? I have tickles. Inside my tummy. Aha! That sounds like you have a case of the tummy flutterbites. They happen whenever you're nervous about something. Well, I, uh, I have to do a show and tell, but I, I'm not sure I want to do it. It sounds very scary talking in front of everyone. Well, of course. Uh, Cup champion bouncer like my good self never gets the tummy flutterbys, but I do know this. You need to be brave, Benji. You need to find your courage. That will get rid of the flutterby. So, with the help of his friends, Benji set off to find his courage. under here. We've looked everywhere. Where could it be? Uh, what did you say you were looking for? Porridge? Cabbage? Or, or, or fudgy fudge? No, Alfie. We're looking for courage so Benji can do show and tell. Oh, oh, I love show and tell. All the attention is on you and it always ends with a big round of applause. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Oh, oh, oh. They've gone. Tough crowd. I love bouncy bumps. So that's what I'll speak about. A show and tell. <laughs> Splendastic! I'm going to talk about the time I was in charge of the Lionheart Games Day. And I've decided to sing a song about dancing. <laughs> You've got favourite things to talk about. Uh-oh. Time was running out. Benji hadn't even thought what he could speak about. 
he needed to find his courage, and quickly, there was only one place left to look. Echo Caves. Courage? Are you there? No, I can't do it. <sighs> Which means I can't do show and tell. Not without my courage. Then we'll find it for you. Come on, let's go. But the caves were so dark, it was hard to see where their paws and hooves were going. I'd better draw them a lantern. There you go. Thank you! Oh, I can't see Benji's courage anywhere. <sighs> Let's go back. We can keep looking along the way. Oh, but how do we get back? back, back. Ralphie! Lily Bay! Bella! We need to go back! Benji waited and waited, but his friends didn't come. I think Benji's friends are lost. I wonder what he's going to do. <gasps> I'm going to go and find them. So off Benji went into the dark caves. Now, there's something you should all know about Benji. Benji makes paper hearts to give to his friends when they're worried or sad. But today, Benji used his paper hearts for something else. Now I won't get lost. You found us. It was scary being lost in here. This will help you feel better. Sorry, Benji. We couldn't find your courage. <laughs> but we didn't need to. Benji found it right here. Bella is right. You wanted to help your friends, so courage came from your heart. And you did it all in the dark. Oh, that is so brave. I guess I just needed to believe in myself. Hey, my tummy doesn't tickle anymore. Oh, the Flutterbys have gone. Yay! Let's get back to class! Benji and his friends followed the trail of paper hearts all the way out of the caves and headed back to class, where Benji told everyone about his brave adventure in the caves. And we found our way back by following my trail of hearts. <laughs> it was my favourite adventure ever! <laughs> because it was with my most favourite thing of all. My friends! <laughs> the whole class cheered and their adventures played on forever after. That was the best story ever. Oh. Well now, what should we call it? Tommy Flutterbys. <laughs> right. Tommy Flutterbys it is. Hmm. I wonder what story will be next.